Hey everyone, today we're going to be unboxing and taking a closer look at this LTC Nimbleback NB832 wireless mechanical keyboard. We'll open it up, show you what's in the box, and give you a closer look at the keyboard and some of the features. Now, of course, if you are interested in this keyboard, it is linked below in the description so you can find more information or pick one up for yourself. But let's go ahead and dive right into it. So quick look at the box here. Again, this is the LTC Nimbleback NB832 mechanical keyboard. Now this is the black version of the keyboard. It's also available in white. And some of the specs here, I'll just point them out. It's an 82 key keyboard. Um, the interface is USB. There is RGB backlighting. The size and weight is there if you do want to pause it and have a closer look. And this is also supported for both Windows and Mac. So let's go ahead and pull this open. So in the box here, of course, we've got the user manual, which shows you what comes in the box, some of the basic information, the different connection types. So you can connect it in three ways. So there's a wired connection. There's also a Bluetooth connection and you can connect up to three devices there. There's also the 2.4 G mode for connection. It also goes over the basic controls for both Windows and Mac. So a lot of information in there on the keyboard. I do also want to point out, it says it has a 60 day money back guarantee for any reason and an 18 month warranty for quality related issues. At the top here, it looks like there's some accessories under here. We'll pull that out. So we've got our cable. If you're wanting to do the wired connection, that's a USB A to USB C. Seems like a decent quality cable. And then we've got a keycap and switch puller in there with some extra switches. So there's four of those in there. And then of course the keyboard itself. So that's what the keyboard looks like there. That looks really sleek. Um, feels fairly heavy, so it doesn't feel like it's gonna slide around on your desk too much. Now I really like this three-tone kind of look to it with the aqua green, the black, and the gray. I really am liking that. Nice little unit. Now this is an 82 key keyboard, so it doesn't have the number pad off to the right. So nice and small, should be great for your desk or for both work and play actually. Nice little unit. Up in the top right hand corner here, it's got this little intuitive knob that you can rotate and push in for play, pause and volume control. Well, I'm really liking the feel of this keyboard. It's not too loud. It says it's gasket mounted with five sound layers. That's definitely noticeable for a softer sound on this mechanical keyboard. Now these keys are also hot swappable for easy do it yourself key changes. Again, it did come with the keycap puller and switch puller in there. And the switches are pre lubed linear switches. Quick look around the keyboard here. It does say nimble back on the front. That looks nice and sleek. And I did notice there's some rubberized feet here on the bottom so it doesn't slide around too much on your desk. And then on the top, we've got a switch here for 2.4G and Bluetooth, as well as the USB-C connection if you are running it wired. Then down on this end, we've got our 2.4G dongle, like that, so you can plug that into your USB port on your computer. So I'll get this connected to my PC here so you can see what the RGB looks like when it's up and running. So I turned down the lights here so you can see the RGB on the keyboard. That looks really sleek in the background here. Lots of different controls, function and the slash. You can turn that on and off. You can also do different um, backlight modes. So function and up would go through different background modes. There's 17 dynamic preset backlit modes that you can choose from, so a lot of them there. You can also hit down on arrow with function, which would go through different colors as well. And then forward and back with the function would adjust the speed as well. So um, lots of different modes there for you to choose from. So just a super quick look at the included software. Of course, you can adjust the language in here. You can change the tap sensitivity the sleep timer, as well as debounce in here. You can reset it. Now, what most people are probably looking for is the key assignment. So you can adjust the keyboard assignment right in here. There's also mouse, there's multimedia. So adjusting the pause, play, etc. You've got macros, you've got commands, as well as key combinations in here. And there's a little save button and you can create different profiles. Of course, there's lighting effects in here that you can go through. 
And then of course there's standard effects. And then at the bottom here, we've got macro edit panel. So lots of different options here for customizing your keyboard with the software. So all in all, the LTC Nimbleback NB832 wireless mechanical keyboard feels really nice. I really like how quiet and smooth the keys are because I'm not too big on super clicky keyboards, but I do like a little bit of a click. Now it is a 4,000 milliamp hour rechargeable battery for extended use in here, which is great for recharging it. You're not always putting batteries in it. And again, it's got the three modes for connection, the wired as well as the Bluetooth and the 2.4 G mode. So a great little keyboard. And I think it should be great for gamers or for your daily driver on both PC and Mac.